More than 5,000 people are presumed dead and another 10,000 are missing in northeastern Libya following the collapse of two dams after heavy rains. This disaster has exacerbated the flooding in already inundated regions. Here is more information. Tamar Ramadan, head of International Federation of Red Cross and Red Crescent Society's delegation in Libya, provided these alarming numbers during a briefing in Geneva, Switzerland. The death toll is described as massive, with at least 5,300 people presumed dead, although this number have not been independently verified. Among the deceased, at least 145 were Egyptian nationals. In the severely affected city of Derna, approximately 6,000 people remain missing, making the situation catastrophic. And certain neighborhoods have reportedly been washed away, hospital and inoperable, and more goods are full, leading to bodies being left outside on sidewalk. This devastating event resulted from a powerful low pressure system that caused catastrophic flooding in Greece before moving into the Mediterranean and evolving into a medicaine. Rising Mediterranean temperatures linked to climate change likely intensified the storm. Libya's vulnerability to extreme weather is exacerbated by its long-standing political conflict with rifle administration and the effective risk communication, rescue operation, and infrastructure maintenance, making the country more susceptible making the country more susceptible to such disasters.